Yeah, so we haven't really started today. Um, we're going to Mass St. Patrick's at 7.15 in the morning. We're leaving at 7. Um, and Carly and I have been trying to do this like every day, wake up early, start your day early, um, and like do a, like, a workout. And we've been actually very successful <laughs> since training. So um, we're gonna do like a quick 30 minute hit workout um, and then get ready for Mass. And then we have a long day today. Um, yeah, getting ready for the week. Um, with our learning our human dignity presentations. So it's really exciting stuff. Human Dignity presentation given by Genesis and Lucas. Um, yeah, so we're gonna hear the talk fully through, um, and then this evening we're gonna they're gonna break it up into sections, and we're gonna start learning the talk. Um, I'm going over the different sections of the Human Human Dignity presentation. So. Um, few pages of just reading over the material and kind of getting familiar with it because this the next session that I'm going into this afternoon is going to be broken up um, and just like explained more thoroughly of yeah of like what the um, themes are <laughs> um, yeah so I'm just yeah so I'm just like going over the material <laughs> So today, um, after our second Human Dignity um, presentation overview, we, um, Team LA and Team Cleveland took their team photos. It was incredible. So, what yeah. made you want to join the Culture Project? <sighs> oh my gosh. <laughs> That's an amazing question. Um, long story short, I saw a video. I believe it was a Culture Project. Now I'm like really trying to like process if it was. Um, but I remember it, it was about these young people who were like living out their faith as like missionaries and Catholics who wanted to bring like freedom and truth to so many young hearts who were thirsting for truth. And I remember like seeing that video and it impacted me. I was like, I want to be part of something like that one day. So fast forward, the Culture Project came to speak. They gave a dating talk in the spring of 2018. I loved it. Believe me though, I was like totally judging myself thinking, could I do that one day? Like, I have a story to share on like human dignity and sexual integrity, um, but can I do that? Um, so that my whole last year at Franciscan, it was just like, God, what do you want from me? <laughs> like, what do you want from me? And I took it to prayer and my last semester, I actually spent it abroad in Gaming, Austria. And during that last semester, actually last mass, funny story, Father Seraphim calls me up, the like the graduates from the from the Austria program to come up and just share, like, literally ask me, what is what are you doing after after this, after you graduate? And I was like, <laughs> my first response was like, I uh, I don't know, God's will. <laughs> and then I then I immediately said, and then I'm gonna apply to be a missionary for the culture project. Right then and there, I had this like overwhelming joy and peace because yeah, because I know I desired, I desire to share the truth of what I've experienced, um, of love, an authentic love that is possible and is real. And yeah, that's what truly brought me here. So. And right now we literally have free time for the rest of the evening and we're at the beach <laughs> and there's a few other missionaries um, that are out there and we're just gonna hang and pray rosary. Mm -hmm. 